Welcome to the second Formula One Grand Prix of 2010 in Australia. The venue is in the heart of the city, Albert Park. On this 5.3 kilometer circuit, fierce outbreaking maneuvers occur just meters after the start in the Jones Chicane, a key spot that can determine the course of the race. After the long Brabham straight, it's back immediately into a crisp right-left combination. Attack and pull past or be outbraked yourself. The first section of the circuit is a tough test of driving skill. It's on now to the circuit's next crucial spot, the Marina Chicane. The drivers need to find the ideal line, otherwise they lose time as they accelerate out and thus lose speed on Albert Road. But beware, this road circuit has its share of perils. In general, it's regarded as very slippery. And then there's bumpy asphalt too ahead of the Clark chicane. It's difficult to go cleanly into the turn. Taken flat out 68% of the time, Melbourne is one of the faster tracks on the calendar. The key spots, however, tend to be slow. So the setup is trimmed to provide lots of downforce and grip. And this is especially needed on the final sector. Ascari, Stewart, Senna and Prost, no less than four hairy corners, just before the end, demand plenty of the drivers. While overtaking is generally not regarded as easy at Albert Park, Australia certainly does invite the odd attack or two. A thrilling second race awaits teams, drivers and fans.